institutional building designed by English philosopher and social theorist Jeremy Bentham in the late 18th century. The concept of the design was to allow the watchman to observe Opticon, all pan inmates of an institution without their being able to tell whether or not they're being watched. Ich bin Gott im Fremden Reich. Wir sind nicht dieselbe Gleich. I am gone in France. We are just not the same. Germans tried to kill them all in 42. And of course, you know, Franz Kafka was a Jew. Franz and God cannot compare. He goes on vacation there. Josephina Point, I cannot decom. A caring someone witches you. Whether or not cog, this is true. Joseph, though, did not know where Coe thought to do. Anyone who studies men would know this. 
So they published Kafka's trial in 25. He dead, not finish it. Bratwurst not full live. Instant message, cop or not. You look like a black horse 10 a cab. You are 30 years old, you say. Then you will remember the day marked by menacing complexity. And Charlie had no tanks at Quang Tree. Must have been cool. All them big machines. Anyone who hunted Charlie knows this. Out there, it was just me and three Marines. I say this, and not in jest. You are under. You are under, you are under, you are under.
your own for years. began to think about Valerie. Brandon thinks about Valerie whenever he is bored. Brandon is bored when he is not terrified. Ask Valerie to marry him, not to be some other guy. But that will not matter. Valerie will give her a sense. She wants babies, lots of babies. It is true like Vietnam. It is 1968. It is about time. Sir William Marines were Ugmar candies and wear a crime. Red Feather say he and his partner weigh about 300 pounds, rifle and rounds. Red Feather, sniper or viper. Valerie could carry the weight, but Spice Branch and Hannah, she has a flat six, two thirty continental up front. Like a high octane version of our Cessna 170. Back home in Indiana. Valerie is a tomboy type. She wants out tricks. It smells a little like ivory soap. Brandon got close enough to smell her hair, but they were making decorations for the prom. He wanted to ask her, afraid she would say no. Neither one of them went to prom. and shy, unless she forgot to be when talking about horses or bugs. She was small with thick greens and even thicker glasses. Yeah, Valerie was a nerd, but so was Brandon. Now, Red Feather's partner show up at least two hours before Skylet, and even though it is dark, Brandon sees the partner. He's a Vietnamese girl. Someone's 
creature is watching us, and this time all of them have something that can shoot. John Star's pocket flash, Valerie's engine roars. She darts down the road with rifles diving in ditches. If he'd have known how Valerie could cook, he would have long known them son of a bitches. They would have run away to Canada and lived peaceful in a cozy cabin. Oh, man, you gingerbread boys. Most of the flash collider park low, bank rights, head into the sun. 2000 AGL. Nothing is like any of us Charlie into the 
the babysitter. <laughs> you thought we would not come after you. Oh, dear. Panopticon sees everything. This does not portend a happy ending. The kid died looking straight at death and had no fear. Endings don't get much happier than that. Now, tell us what you did to Valerie.
have waited, sir. Nobody ever came by. Everybody wants to see justice. Tell me, sir, why did you lie? I told you the truth all along, boy. The gate was only for you. Now, when your old life is closing, I will close the gate too. begins to think about Brandon. Valerie thinks on Brandon when she is alone. Valerie is alone when she looks on the sky. Brandon has bright eyes. Brandon can fly. Inside the church is Bishop Bob, a pious man who loves his job. Galilee sees Valerie kneeling there with Burford's prayer and shining braided hair. Her fiance is of the war, her prayer is sincere, her heart full sore. And high up the bell tower above, where she first refused her brand's love. Squeeze her eyes shut, Brandon, face the music in a happy place. Round ball turrets, nipples whirl. Sad is boundary, unhappy girl. Thank you. 
shaking with a roaring roar. The movements on earth will drop away. For Valerie, who flew that day, one day she will be the one. Say Brandon took her hand. Ancient music bubbled up around the wedding band. Saved her virtue just for granted, and the blessings of God by way of Pastor Bob. He pets cats, smiles at grandmas, shakes their hands, and loves his job. Bishop Bob uses hands for other things, but not installing wedding rings. Tears grip tight, roll down her face. He is smelling. They wrote the vows, and they set the date. And Bishop Bob counseled young Valerie to wait the saving of her sacred skin and letting her young Brandon in. It is late summer night. Cloud, thunder, third moon, to Bishop Bob, studying hard to read. Rigorous scripture, fist pumps, a sermon intercourse. In the end of the week, he plunged young boys into rectories, calming tales and dying tears. A little girl's giggle and tingle in secret. How only God can have that whisper. Tell my weights for those with stories. Little lamb who made me box. Beautiful Zion wilts and stops. Tissue dabs blot up the seminary ridge on little round top chairs. Squeak the wheels and zip the cannon back into its secret lair. Bogle clakes on death protector. And it's suddenly ice cap wheel. Banshee well and tower bell, and it sounded coffin near. And licking tongues of flame, dust of death, and demon stark. It flew from bell to manning, which bishop of the spire. Mark! It shrieked a name. Brandon! Oh, it's not your daddy grave rush up at two o'clock. Brandon, fire! Underneath my right wing. Fire off, rocket. Take me flying, Brandon. I am dying. Found me. Found me. Found me. Oh my God, Brandon! Ah, I cannot breathe. I, Cardinal, breathe. 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 Brandon. Phantom from behind the hate, and fate a few stains hurt. Bishop Bob lies a sectary and quietly lifts her skirt. Push the cannon into sacred skin and give a squirt. Ring the bell, open hell, another holy lie to tell. And judgment drips come from above. Bishop Bob gives Valerie a more firm and deliberate shock. Valerie spread fear, but she waited. Valerie fly! Valerie fall! Crush gold concrete! Die. Phone the police and call them all. And clean up come with telegram from Ethan. What coming? 
saw senseless, disorientating, menacing complexity. My God, that would certainly take genius. We have just been through the Great War. World War II? What? There is another one? Is this happening now? The Nazis! But you see all the guns and parades and flags and the uniforms everywhere. My God, how could you miss that? And the choppers! The teeny ploppers! Hot car popper! Better movie! Apocalypse now! We felt so fine back in 79! But it happened again somehow!
use the church few. Satan is her brains to paint a parking lot. Motor oil sold. Thanks. A lot.
jump through hoops now. Dialectic loops. Do you think the war drum? Come into our great troops. Getting ready to jump through hoops. You get to be a conspiracy. Eat and hoops. And be surprised with an act of quagmire roll. Being the leader of a band of gold. And silver tongue is my role. All because you jump through hoops. We must end the bureaucracy. The kind you do not see. But you know they seize the people hatching little groups all to make them jump through hoops. You get a thousand rows of cubicle chicken coops, a thousand eyes and a cyanite spy hole, sense and orbit, a friendly pie hole, selling us to jump through hoops. Let's have 